<laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Why are you trying to disobey your king? I'm not just your mate. Hey, I'm Daniel. This is Alex. We're here for Azrael. Wow, who is she? She's so cute. Uh, my grandma isn't home. No way, Azrael's your grandma. I haven't seen you here before. Are you new in town? Uh, yeah, I just moved in today. Hi, right. I'm Alexander Roosevelt. Uh, hi, um, I'm Victoria Gibbons. <laughs> Why can't I read his mind? You're human. Uh, yeah, last time I checked. Yes, everyone is very friendly, so stop worrying. Um, by the way, there were these two guys who came looking for you. Uh, Daniel and Alexander. Who are they? The Roosevelt family own this town. Alexander and Daniel are best friends. Keep away from them. <laughs> Why? Alpha Alexander, the traitor has confessed that the rebels are gathering a troop near our border recently. Troops? Yes. Interesting. Alpha, there is one more thing. I've received a few inquiries about your Luna. As you know, according to our laws, if you've not chosen a Luna by your coronation, then you must hold an election. Hold Leonardo. What if my Luna were to be human? Hey, Victoria. She looks adorable today. Or at least she could be my mate. Hey, Daniel. <laughs> we're in the same class. Wanna to go together? Yeah, um, where's Alexander? Uh, he's hosting the full moon party. Full moon party? Yeah, it's like a town tradition sort of thing. <laughs> Do you wanna join us? Oh, no, I'm not really into that kind no, of- No, it's just a house party. You need to have a good time. Make some new friends. All right, fine, I'll come. <laughs> a human girl? Never in the history of Larkins has a human girl become a Luna. So? Because humans are not strong enough to be a Luna. Now, if you don't mind, I've made a list of some suitable suggestions. Old Leonardo, didn't you say that we have a prisoner to execute? Yes, Alpha. Victoria, are you my faith in my my baby? Wow, this place is amazing. Is this Alexander's house? Yeah, and some of us live here too. Should we move? Oh no, I don't dance. <laughs> so you do. No, oh my god. <laughs> this is so bad. I ask you a question. Yeah. Why are you here? Excuse me, let go. You're hurting me. What's going on? Victoria's my guest. I invited her. Why would you invite her here? This is not a place you should be. Let me go. Are you crazy? You're driving me crazy. Do you like Daniel? What? You barely know him. You don't understand how dangerous it is. Excuse me? You don't understand how dangerous it is. What? Do you like Daniel? You barely know him. Maybe I like him. At least he's a gentleman, unlike someone. She never liked it when you told her what she should do Never listened to the way the wind blew Easy as 
He should leave. Now. Fine. I'm not interested in some stubby rich kid's party. Alex, are you okay? Why'd you yell at Victoria like that? I don't get it. Why'd you bring her to a party for werewolves? I thought, be good I thought it'd be good for her to meet everyone. Besides, I'm here, she's safe. Do you like her? What? Yeah, I mean, she's special, but I've never been out with a human girl before. I warned you, stay away from her. Why so aggressive? She's not yours. Excuse me, my alpha. That girl is such a slut. I saw her flirting with Daniel. Enough, my love. Well, maybe she won't be bothering us for long. I saw some rogues were spotted in town earlier this morning. What? What's wrong with me? God, I know it. I know that guy. He's from my dream. God, what the hell is going on? God, God, please, you cannot let me die by being eaten by some giant wolf. Okay, think, Victoria, think. You can, you can do this. You, you, you big, bad wolf, you... Just, just please don't eat me. What, you want me to, you want me to pat you? Okay. Okay, um, good, good boy. That's all right, that's all right, yep, yep. Um, it's okay. We're, we're okay. Um, so, um, uh, do you live in the forest? <laughs> what, what's your name? <laughs> you know, you're, um, you're, you're hell. It sounds just like that. <laughs> Okay. I'll call you somebody. <laughs> hey grandma, it's me again. I'm still alive and uh, everything's going great. Except I uh, kind of befriended this wolf last night. It's a long story, Victoria. but hey. uh, I'll call you back. Is this seat taken? I don't see anyone else here. Can we talk? Sure. Victoria, I just wanted to apologise. About last night. At the party. I mean, I'm hoping that we can forget about all that. Start over. Kiss him now. What? What? Uh, <laughs> I um, I mean, I, I I wanted to say I was sorry too. I mean, you were definitely rude to me. No doubt about that. But I realize I maybe shouldn't have been there. Let's not rehash all that again, hey? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. So, friends. Friends. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't even realize the time. Oh my god, I could not be late for another lecture. I... Hey. 
Thank you. The Stoner sign of Robert or his dogs. The Border Patrol have reported that there's just no sign of them. Thank you, Layla. You can go now. Alex. Does everything have to be so formal? Layla. I'm going to be the Alpha King next month. And you're my gamma. We're not children anymore. Well, maybe it's time that you and I move forward. You don't need to choose your Luna, Alex. I'm your Luna. Layla. If you don't mind, I need to speak to Elf Alexander in private. Fine. I'll be waiting for you. You know where to find me. Bye, Father. Rest assured, I've already found my Luna. Wow. What pleasant news. You have found your Luna. She is drawing me to her, like gravity. And yet she is human. What pleasant news. You have found your Luna. She is drawing me to her like gravity. And yet she is human. Her name is Victoria. A human girl? I hope you're joking. You're acting like it's the end of the world. My wolf Damien confirms it is her. And who knows? Maybe she has a wolf. She just hasn't found her yet. If she is over 18, and she is a werewolf, yet her wolf hasn't come out yet, then she could be more dangerous than a dark witch. Victoria, my name is Carla. We finally meet. You. You're the voice in my head. You're a wolf? Yes, I am Carla, your wolf, Victoria. From this moment on, you are no longer wolfless. I, my what? I, I'm no longer wolfless? What does that even mean? Should everyone have a wolf? You grew up without a pack. It's no wonder you don't know anything about werewolves. <laughs> Werewolves. Okay, now I know I am dreaming. Victoria, you're not dreaming. I am inside you. I am <gasps> your wolf. I actually can't stand this Victoria girl anymore. Do you really think she's related to that witch, Azriel? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so they're not related. Interesting. You're not a fan. How you don't know that? Hey, Victoria. We we're just talking about you. Can we have lunch? Watch where you're going, human. S sorry. Alex, honey, I brought you your favorite food. Um, uh, Daniel, the pizza looks great, but um, I I've kind of got this thing that I got to go to now, so um, maybe next time. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Hey, why are you running away from me? I thought you were with your girlfriend. Girlfriend? Who? I don't have a girlfriend. Oh, really? Does she know about that? You mean Layla. Layla is not my girlfriend. We've known each other since childhood. Like Daniel, she's a friend. She's not your mate? Of course not. Who told you that? Was it Daniel? That's not something to joke about. I don't get mad. Okay, I was just... Sorry. I just meant how I'm your mate, you're my mate, that sort of thing. Victoria, are you serious? What? Yeah. 
Aren't we all mates here? Are you my mate? Do you want to be my mate? Do you want to be my mate? I am so sorry. <laughs> Come on, let's get you something to eat. Hey, I'm glad you changed your mind. Have a seat. She has no shame. Don't tell me you're not hungry. Uh, so, looks like you don't get many newcomers. <laughs> well, we're a small community compared to New York. What brought you here? Uh, well, after my parents passed away in this car accident last year, uh, my grandma, Ezreal, invited me to move in with her. So, here I am. <laughs> I never knew that about you, Vicky. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for your loss. You're here with us, like a big family. What a cliche. Dead parent story? Really? Such a pity. You know what? It's actually okay. Um, don't feel sorry for me. I'm fine. I'm just happy you guys accept me to be a mate. <laughs> <laughs> Layla, can you not? Did I say something funny? <laughs> no, no. Uh -huh. Never mind. Mate is not what it means when I told you that. But you guys keep saying these like mate things. Like, why can't I be your mate and Angela's mate? And your mate rather. Of course. Why not? Take my jacket. I'm so sorry. Fight back. Are you going to let her get away with that? She shall be punished. If I were you, I would break her arms right now. Enough! Shut up! Trying to take my man? Who do you think you are? You brought it on yourself. It's not your fault, but you need to calm down. Your panic will only trigger your powers to protect you more. Carla, how do I calm down? I nearly broke that girl's arm. Oh, shit! Carla, what is this? I told you, you need to calm down and learn how to control your power properly before things will go wrong. This power, this magma thing, comes from me? Why did you run off like that? You're faster than a wolf. Are you following me? No, I just... I saw you after the Layla thing. That I was the one to blame? That I hurt your girlfriend? Is that it? I know you would never do that. Why did you run off like that? You're faster than a wolf. Are you following me? I just wanted to check if you're okay. Well, how thoughtful of you. Look, why don't you just go back to her? It looks like she needs you. Okay, what are you laughing at? You. I see. You're jealous. I am not jealous. Okay, why, why would I be jealous? I, I have plenty of other mates to talk to and hang with. Like Daniel, for instance. I am your mate. Your eyes, they're, they're glowing.
Give me a minute. Does your girlfriend want you? Miss Victoria Gibbons. Would you be my girlfriend? My one and only mate. <laughs> <laughs>